Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Bioshock 2 Remastered. Uh, so the last episode we made our way here to Popper's Drop, uh, where we figured out that a woman, uh, I forget her name, first name, uh, was it Grace or something like that? It's Grace? Uh, I don't think that's her first name at all, but her last name is Holloway, uh, who was, uh, out for vengeance, uh, because apparently we stole Eleanor from her. Uh, so hopefully we can figure out what that's all about. Uh, before we move forward into Popper's, uh, Drop, uh, let me go ahead. Over there. I still have this little sister that I stole uh, last episode, so let's go ahead and see if we can grab some more Adam. Maybe get an upgrade before we go deeper uh, into uh, into Popper's Drop downtown. Wow, where are you taking me? Oh, this guy. Oh, is this actually happening? Are we actually having this? Okay, well, I'm out of ammo, so this is not good. Whoa, big guy. Come on now. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, well, this is not good, because I have no ammo, dude. How much damage does that guy do? Oh, he's gonna run? No, 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 no. Oh, the guy's back. Okay, cool. Well, not cool, but... Oh my gosh, what am I doing right now? This sucks. Do I have any heavy roots? Hey, 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 hey. Let's, let's cut this out now here, pal. Is there only one of these dudes? Roots? Splicer. Uh, okay. <laughs> Whatever, man. Um, that guy, I wish, uh, that guy wasn't too difficult. Maybe if I had a little bit more ammo, it would have been okay. I'm sure that there will be more of those guys in the, uh, in the future here. Uh, okay, so I guess you're the guy with the atom. Is there an ammo store around here somewhere? Um, well, let's see what we can get, at least. This is it. It's over. I built this railroad from nothing. Played by Mr. Ryan's rules. But then he asks me to sink my own cash reserves into the banks to give Rapture some breathing room. And now, now Austin goddamn Bathysphere wants to buy me out. Decommissioned the entire rail. I have no family and no time for friends. I am the Atlantic Express. And this, this is the end of the line. This guy takes his uh, trains very seriously. All right, let's see if we can uh, not mess this up. There we go, sweet. I got, uh, I think I got two, uh, two blues there. All right, how much monies do I got? Can I get a shotgun already? That would be pretty sick, actually. Um, I'll take some of those. The heavy rivets, the uh, rivets, rivets, <laughs> the heavy for my frog gun. The heavy, heavy rivets. Um, uh, fifty caliber rounds. We definitely need ammo. I hate to. I really do hate to waste a lot of money on this. Wait, what? Take a swig of Dr. Hallcroft's wondrous, wondrous cure-all to refill some. Okay. How many of that can I buy? Uh, okay, drill fuel. Let's get some of that. Wow, I really hate to waste all my money here, but I need some ammo. I'm running out. Um, and I don't have my, uh, my frozen wrench that I had from Bioshock, so that's kind of a bummer. Can I get in here? Hello. All right. Well, let's get on with the show. Do we have any um I don't think there's any bots. Oh, man, there's an ammo store up there too. Well, that kind of sucks. All right. Uh what do we got? What do we got? This Sure. Let's do that. Actually Okay, little sister, please don't scare me like that ever again. All right, do your thing and hurry up because I ain't got much. I don't know if I'll be able to protect you. 
turn her from us just as he did to Eleanor. Show this thing what befalls the boogeyman when he steps into our god. Oh, you know what? Um... I think I kind of understand. What the heck? Hey, hey! Get the heck away! Get away from her! I'm getting some shotgun ammo now. I wonder if I should have a shotgun at this point. Hey, get... No, don't even. Get wrecked. No, no. Nope. I'm going to try to melee as much as possible if I hadn't made that clear through my actions already. Uh, because I don't, I really don't want to waste a lot of ammo. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Something's hitting real hard here. Get wrecked. All right, are you done? <laughs> Little sister, are you done? Can we, like, can we not do this anymore? That'd be fantastic. Come on. Are we gonna be together again, Daddy? Uh, yes, but also I'm gonna dump you off in the, um, in the vent. <laughs> Wherever the heck that is. I don't think I have access to that vent. Is there one up here? There is. All right, let's backtrack a little bit. Now I have no... Uh, I have no health either. Cause I'm just getting my just butt handed to me. All right, rescue. All right, just get in the get in the vent. Just get in the vent. All right. Thank you. Yep, no problem. See ya. Oh wait, get in there. What are you doing? Hurry up. Go. Be safe. Uh, food cart. Why is that a named object? That's kind of weird. All right, and what do we got here? Eve plasmid slot. Um, what is that? Why it's your footsteps and increases damage from melee attacks on unaware opponent opponents? Okay, I don't think I want that one. Your electrical attacks disable security of it. Your headshots do more damage. Extra nutrition? No. Hacking needle moves slightly slower. Reduces all physical damage. Slap that on me, please. Oh man, what is this? Drill power. What does drill power do? Your drill does more damage when you spin or swing it. You move slightly faster every time you hack something. First aid kits also give you Eve. Let's replace it with that. Huh? <laughs> Let's do that. Uh, yeah, that seems good. I like that. And then we, do we have enough for some more Eve? Do an Eve upgrade as well. Oh, and let's do a, uh, another tonic slot. Booze Hound, Eve Link, so that we can just put in our, our, uh, our thingy. Our new, our, um, what am I trying to say? We can put in our... Uh, the thing that we just equipped, unequipped. Wow. I just had the biggest brain fart of all time. All right, let's move on into Pauper's job. A little bit further, at least. Oh, look at this place. Is this the first, like, glass tunnel that we've been in? This is kind of cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, uh, look out. Is there a, um... So, the theory is that there's a, a big sister that watches you. It's kind of like a giant game of Where's Waldo. There's like little sisters that watch you from the water. Either I missed it and she already swam away, or... Huh. The Sin... What is this one? The Sinclair Deluxe. Okay, that's his, uh, Sinclair's Hotel. Right. Alright, let's get in here. Uh, what I was about to say is that, um, Holloway, Holloway's not saying that we stole Eleanor directly from her, but, um, what Holloway is saying is that, at, collectively, as a group, like, 
Dr. Lamb's people, I stole Eleanor from, like, Dr. Lamb's people. I think that's what she's saying. All right, let's pick up that. Price of his Old Papa's drops the worst neighborhood in Rapture, but it's a hell of an opportunity. Well, sport, I guess Gracie's home, but that big lug just dropped half my damn hotel in your way. Now, to break through that mess, I expect you're going to have to work out how he got so burly. Find yourself a genetic research camera, son. You can pick up any number of tricks from a splicer with one of those. Try the pawn shop downtown. I was just over there. This is, that's obnoxious. Uh, now I gotta go all the way back. Uh, alright, how do I access my... things? This thing? There we go. Old Papa's drops the worst neighborhood in Rapture. But it's a hell of an opportunity to raise up some, uh, affordable housing. When Atlantic Express was constructing their luxury passenger line, this place was hollowed out beneath as flop houses for the railway crew. Nobody was supposed to reside down here long term, but when you're broke in this town, you're not exactly swimming in alternatives. I don't favor spending more than an hour or so down here at a time. There ain't a side of the tracks more wrong than under them. Hmm. That should be interesting to explore. I'm kind of, why are some of these like different colors than the other ones? I wonder, usually in video games, if something is, is different colors, means that you can, like, interact with it or something like that. I really would love the shotgun. If I could get that shotgun, I have a ton of ammo for it. Okay, nothing's... Anybody gonna jump out here? Like, what are we doing? Uh, Alright, see if we can get this... Boom. Oh, man. Got it. <laughs> really? A fifth one? <laughs> that makes hacking safes so much easier than in the original Bioshock. I hated hacking the safes in the original Bioshock. It was awful. All right, well, I guess we're going to go back downtown. Kind of a waste of time, what I just did here. All right, uh, big sister? Anybody? Big sister? Fish? Big sisters? Anything? Nope. Fair enough, just fish. Just fish, that's fine. Is there another big daddy in here? Oh, there is another big daddy in here somewhere. Man, I don't really have the ammo for this. Oh, why are you here, dude? You'll live. I'll let you live for now. Wait, where's this? I gotta go down the other step rail? Okay. Okay, navigation thingy. If you want to be that picky, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, pawn shop. Can't get into the pawn shop. It's locked. the pawn shop but it's bolted up tight you'll have to find another way inside i expect yeah thanks sinclair really helpful dude find another way into the pawn shop it looks like there's a thingy over there and we can't get in there because we don't have the code i guess we're going down to skid row which does not seem very uh welcoming okay so this should take us back to Sinclair's hotel or whatever right right so we'll just leave we'll leave that for now whatever's in that little corridor it can stay there I don't care that much skid row hello okay now I'm confused. Uh, do I climb? Oh, there's a, uh, there's an audio log, like, right here. What do they expect? They 
deep enough drug stash in this clinic to spice up a rhinoceros, of course every poor soul in a drop's gonna start beating down your door. It's my job to think up a new key code to keep them out. Seems like every other day now. Nuts. I'll mull it over for a while at the fishbowl diner. What is... What is this? What is up with this... I'm not digging this back and forth action that I got going on right now. Screw you, navigation thing. I'm going the other way. Alright, guess we're gonna go into the diner <laughs> where we already were. Oh, wait. Maybe... Did I already have the code or does the code only show up after you initiate the thing? What is that noise? Do you guys hear that? It's like somebody, it sounds like somebody drinking something. Oh, shotgun, heck yeah. Oh, it's a double barrel? Get wrecked. Hang on. <laughs> Close range? Close range only? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, where's that splicer going? Oh, I like this shotgun. Wait, what is shooting me? Oh, crap. Oh, that's not good. Is that Big Daddy shooting at me? What is the code? What is the code? What is the code? Uh, 0047. 0047. Remember that, guys. Is this Big Daddy mad at me or... Yep. Nope. I don't know if he's mad at me or not, to be honest with you. No, he's chill. Eleanor's grown now, baby snatcher. Even after what you did to her. Dr. Lamb found a way to shape that girl into something perfect, something holy. She's a daughter to us all. Nobody in Rapture will shelter you now. All right, well, whatever, lady. Um, all right, guys, well, I think that's a... Uh... Grace has got the wrong idea. You're not responsible for turning Eleanor into a little sister. Big daddies are just slaves, and you only recently broke free. What the heck is that? What is? What is doing damage to me out here? Did I like run over some sort of trap or something like that? Kind of weird. Uh, all right, guys. Well, I think that's a uh, I think that's a good place to leave things off. Um, I don't want this episode to get ridiculously over time or anything like that. And it's just kind of a shame that I had to do so much back and forth. Uh, on that one, but we got ourselves a shotgun, so that should be pretty cool going forward. Looks like it's super close range, but I'm sure if we upgrade it, it'll be uh, a pretty solid companion uh, going forward. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you guys did enjoy, please definitely drop a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed already. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure to do that so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.